Hey, how's it going guys? It's Choco the Choco Boat and I am back playing some Black Ops 2 and we're going to go for that Choco the Nuclear Solo thing. Uh, we might invite some other people for right now, but for right now we're going to be doing it solo. Sorry guys, I'm a little bit still on the loopy side. Uh, but of course, we are going to be running this class I got along fairly well with on a previous episode. So I'm going to give that another try and then maybe we'll do some tweaking here and there. Um, I'm, I'm getting the feeling that that suppressor might have to come off. I'm not really sure though because that, that element of surprise, if I do get it, is really handy. Um, we are also going to be doing these streaks right here. The reason why I'm running EMP is because I'm not too confident about uh, people not being scumbags and having a counter UAV while I have a VSAT. So that's why that's there. It's a one more kill and like some a couple of assist points and change. Um, like it's a hundred points more, right? So yeah, that's the yeah yeah okay. So that's the reason why I have that. But we'll see how it goes. Um, I had one up. I had one warm up round really quick just to kind of see how it felt. And these are not bad players, so this is going to be a bit of a challenge. But we'll see how it goes. I'm also still on that 300 search preference, so I think right now I'm going to average out maybe 130 ping or so, maybe a little bit north of that. But that's okay, because honestly, it's still about having just some fun, just trying trying pretty hard, actually, and uh, hoping that we don't completely botch it. Holy cow, teammate, that scared the living daylights out of me. All right, and then we're going to just push up right here. And thank God, it's that right there. Those suitcases always make me think that there's a guy crouched right there. And it's never a guy. It's always just those suitcases, but I always think that. And man, I'm just getting dropped right at the tip. That is just, that's brutal, man. All right, so let's just go ahead and zoom on up here. Oh, oh God. Oh, no, sniper sees me. Don't do it, sniper. Oh, no. <laughs> I dodged the sniper only to be eaten alive by another guy on the side. And I think he had a cheek comb, which makes it double the insult to injury. And I got picked off by the DSR. I cry every time, but that's okay. Let's go. Oh, no. Oh, lag screw doodles. Why? I blame the lag screw doodles. That was not me. I'm 0 and 5. Forget choking to nuclear. This might be enemy team to nuclear. This is not going well. And that's putting it very, very gently. All right. Dang, man, I'm getting absolutely smoked. We might have to go back to the 5-7 because we all know 5-7 is bay, man. 5-7 has always been somewhat good to us. And we might need to, we might need to go back to our roots here. Whoa. Okay, well, we got that guy. But I'm pretty sure there's more of them behind. I think there's some more down there, but I'm not going to worry about that right this second. Whoa! I panic. I'm not going to lie. I panic. Just hardcore panic mode right there. That was just, that was bad. All right, oh, I need to focus. I need to get my, I need to get my kind of groove going. I'm a very streaky player, if you guys haven't noticed. Every now and then you'll watch me do really, really well and then really, really poorly, even across different lobbies. And I'm just, my mentality is by and far the major factor when I play Call of Duty and games like this is that I get, I get either really stoked and I start going into the zone and I just give no shrimps whatsoever. And then sometimes, like just right now, I'm just cold as can be, and I cannot, for the life of me, seem to get anything done. I can't seem to get any production. I, I know I saw a dude. I know he's over here somewhere. I don't know where is over here, but he's over here somewhere. Hmm. All right, well, we're going to just dip down into here. No. Hmm. I am at a loss for where they would be. All right, we'll drop this guy. Oh. All right, teammate got him. Thank you. Oh, no! Teammate, can you get him? Ooh, okay, I'm going to keep on firing as I go back. I'm out. Oh, man, that was some scary stuff right there. All right, we're just going to... Oh, man. This guy just wrecked me. I don't, I, yeah, that is the Chico. Whew, man, he is on point with those shots. I must give my kudos to him. Thankfully, the team is winning, so at the very least, the team will get the win. If not me getting anything that resembles a streak going but honestly at the end of the day I think I'm all right with that I think I'm all right with the team getting ahead but my gracious me it's like I have zero awareness honestly it feels like I just don't know what's happening around me like I'm not I must not be checking the minimap or something so I need to focus and really just get my game back because this is not this is this is bad even for me Ooh. oh that's teammate sorry teammate kind of freaked out pretty sure I'm the reason why the teammate just died there. He's probably just like, why did you shoot at me? 
but I panicked, dude. I swear I haven't been playing this game for years and years and should know better. That's just that's just the way the game is played, man. Alright, thankfully this team is carrying my sorry booty right to the whoop. Oh man. Oh, there's a sniper behind me. Alright, we'll let this guy go first. Oh! Really? Wow, that guy just went straight for me. That's insane. He has some really, like, next-level awareness right there. That's the kind of awareness I need. Whoop. But, unfortunately, it's not the awareness that I have. It's the one I need, but not the one I have. Oh! My, oh, my. Aren't we just cheeky today? All right. We're going to double back. I'm pretty sure there's going to be some guys over here. Yep. All right. We got really lucky on that spray right there. But we're going to pop this UAV. All right. Oh, man. I could have had the last kill. All right. So we kind of redeemed ourselves towards the end there. I think I'm starting to kind of get back into the groove. Let's go for one more game. And um, I don't know. Maybe I'll try out the 5-7. Oh, I'm just not sure. Yeah, okay, let's try it. Let's go with the 5.7. Let me try to use the 5.7 and see what happens. My gut feeling is that it's going to actually be worse because I do know that whenever there's like a... Excuse me, my gracious. But whenever I do use the 5.7, the problem with me using the 5.7 is I have a harder time dealing with lag issues. Uh, it's pretty bad, actually, but... We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Hopefully it goes pretty well. If not, not a big deal. We'll figure it out. But let me just run my standard class. And I honestly probably don't need tack mask, but eh, we'll hold on to it. And I will keep this black hat because that actually seems like a fantastical idea. Actually, you know what? Let's even bump that up to an EMP grenade because I feel like that might actually be the way to go because I'm not running um, the silencer class, which is what I normally would run. I'm running my, like, I need to get these shots off, and they need to drop you before you drop me, because I don't think there's a lot of this leeway for, you know, I can sneak around you guys. So, ooh, this map is brutal for me. All right. Just focus, 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 focus. All right, we got this. So, oh, and by the way, I know that you guys are probably like, so, Chogo, about that question? What, do we have an answer? So, I will, I will do my darndest. My current plan is to do the campaign as soon as the game comes out for me. Just rush through the campaign, get that posted, done and dusted, and uh, we'll go from there into the multiplayer. And, yeah, we'll see how that goes. Oh, no, I didn't use the 5.7. Can I still swap? Oh, okay. That's okay. Um, we'll, yeah, we'll figure it out. Obviously not exactly. The oh, man. Wow, auto climb. Oh, man, auto climb. Right there, man. That was not really okay. Although it does seem to be going a little bit better for us this time around. Not great, but still not quite as badly. Right, let's see if this guy's just going to be waiting for us. Here. Oh no, he saw me way before I saw him. <laughs> Alright, that's okay. We're going to push up with a 5.7 and we're going to hope that I am not booty at the moment. Which, uh... Oh man, we just got murked. You got a triple on us. That is rough, boys. Not gonna lie, that is actually really wild that he was able to do that on the fly. Good job to him. Man, oh man. 5-7 oh, just feels so good, though. I don't know what it is about the 5-7 that makes it feel as good as it does. It, it just, everything about the gun just feels right. Like, everything. It's just the firing rate, the accuracy, the everything. Really? I mean, I know it's the 5.7, but still, that should have been more than enough damage to save. Alright, we're going to push up this way. We're going to chuck an EMP over yonder. And we got absolutely no hit markers! Ah, oh, man. That was bad. That was not good. For whatever reason, my brain wouldn't register that he was not on the same height as me, which uh, I ended up paying for, obviously. But okay, we're going to try to get a quick push up here. Whoa! What? What did he jump? Oh, man. it's That's so discombobulating. Those, like, 
Uh, I'm sorry I'm complaining, guys, but it's just, it's really frustrating whenever people jump up onto that, on those, like, weird sloping things. My brain doesn't register that as a, like, as a step. So, uh, like, in my head, I'm just thinking to myself, like, okay, he should be at my height. Like, he shouldn't, like, he should maybe have, like, a foot just kind of awkwardly sitting there, but he should most definitely be at my height. But, nah, he's not. So, that's just, it, can, it throws me off. And that frustrates me. But... Oh, no! Ooh, baby. Alright, let's just run out here. Thank you, Hedwig. Oh, man. I was out. I ran out of bullets right at the end there. That's... Oof, that's rough. Yeah, and honestly, my ping isn't that big of a deal right now. Yeah, I'm at 130. That's not too bad. It's not great, obviously, but it's not bad. So let me, ooh, let's chuck this EMP out there. All right. Oh man, I choked a little bit right there. I, I wasn't sure what was going on. I actually thought I died, so I stopped pulling, uh, but that's okay. Man, I am trying my darndest for you guys right now to be a little bit more upbeat, a little bit more positive, and uh, try not to be as funky about things and not be as qq -y. and it's it's a struggle i'm not gonna lie I, I definitely did pick up some bad habits um along the way at some point wow that i'm actually surprised by i'm surprised that i didn't drop him huh weird all right well any who's a doodles i'm gonna toss this emp over yonder got no hit markers so they're probably gonna be pushing up that right side really soon oh we are getting all kinds of chop right now Okay, yeah, we have all kinds of chop. All right, that's all right. Um, I have a feeling that it, I know what it is, but uh, not much I'm going to be able to do about that right this moment. Oh, yeah, I'm getting phenomenal amounts of chop. Okay, so that's probably part of the reason why we're not having such a great time right now. But that is, again, que sera sera, whatever will be will be. It is not something I'm going to worry all too much about. Cool, I got a headshot in there. That was kind of nice. All right. If only I could convert these headshots to, like from 5.7 to other guns. Oh, that'd be so good. Oh, no! <laughs> that awkward moment when you're climbing and you're just like, uh, would you be so kind as to let me climb and not wreck my day immediately? Down. All right, so let's push up the side here. Oh, we're the last. Ah, uh, man, this is a brutal set of games, though. That is pretty rough. But at least it was a, eh, actually, it wasn't that close. Eh, it's okay. But, alright. And who's the goodles? <laughs> I hope you guys did enjoy this episode of Choking a Nuclear. It's, I don't know. It's going to be pretty rough. I think we might have to call in some backup. Uh, but hopefully, things work out. If not, oh well. It was. It's, it's a pretty lofty goal. But definitely send me all those good feels. Hit that like button down below if you support the whole series and you want me to keep on doing it. Or if you want me to go back... Comment that down below. Let me know. I would be very, very happy to take that feedback. And other than that, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And you all take care of yourselves. And ciao for now.